presented by Hyatt Regency Guam. Cafe Kitchen now open daily for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Hopiday and welcome back. Well, if you have a chance to make your way over to the Chamorro Village Wednesday night market, the place to check out is Amari. Here's more. Every Wednesday night at the Chamorro Village, you can expect not only a great crowd, but great eats. One place you definitely have to check out is Amari. Located in one of the concrete huts, Amari is serving up delicious takoyaki. Owner, Ron Guerrero. Me and my wife, we're just kind of, you know, trying to see what we want to do with, you know, with businesses and in our minds and pretty much try to open up a little bit what we can do. So I guess I had, I had a thing that, because we go to Japan a lot and I see a lot of the Japanese street food that I've seen and it just caught my eye. And I said, you know what, this is probably something that I want to do. I mean, maybe we can try it on Guam and see how it works. I know there's a few uh, takoyaki shops on Guam. Uh, and again, it doesn't, you know, again, there's not a lot, you know, to, to I know a lot of people now on Guam, they're getting used to it so much with the food because they, they, they really like coming down here and just trying to, you know, buy the food, but they can't find it anywhere else. There's only a few places. So that's why we wanted to start something like this here. And I think this is where we're at, you know, at Chamorro Village. <laughs> According to Guerrero, Imari started up at the Chamorro Village sometime in August 2015. Okay, for those of you who still don't know what takoyaki is... It's a battered ball, basically like a, uh, uh, what, how would you say it, uh, the shrimp patties and takoyaki. So basically it's mixing the same thing, the batter, but because after we're done, we actually add sauce in it. Uh, the brown sauce, the Japanese mayo, the Japanese uh, fish flakes, and the uh, seaweed, the nori, that we put on it. So it kind of gives it a little bit of um, um, a sweeter taste. Uh, when you bite into it, but when you bite into it, it has more of a uh, like a crunchier. We make it more crunchier in the outside, so people can. They don't like that. It's it's, it's mushy. Yeah, they don't they don't. In Japan, it's more of a, a mushy feeling when you bite into it. But here, people like it more of a crunchier type. So that's the reason why we do it like that. Crunchy in the outside, a little bit of the texture in the inside. So that's how we do it here. And at Amari, you can choose from different flavors. Right now, the flavors that we do offer and the most popular would be the octopus. Uh, but now uh, the shrimp is kind of catching up with the popularity here. So I think right now it balances out with the octopus and shrimp. But we also do offer the sausage and cheese and we also have bacon and cheese. We have for the vegetarians, we have veggies. Uh, and we also have the garlic chicken. Occasionally, if we do make it, we'll bring it down here and we have it uh, for, for sale. As for future plans with Amari. We do have a food truck coming soon. So the food truck, um, again, you know how some people don't want to drive down here, they want. So again, be on the lookout for the Amari uh, food truck, the Amari snack sack food truck will be ro roaming around soon. For more information and to keep up to date, make sure to head on over to their Facebook page under Amari Guam. That's I-M-A-R-I -I Guam. If you guys want to enjoy some uh, authentic takoyaki, please come on down and check us out. Make sure to check out Amari at the Chamorro Village every Wednesday night and look for the concrete hut with a big sign that says, Takoyaki sold here. And don't forget to tell them that In The Mix sent you. A big thank you to Ron and the entire staff for letting us shoot around them when they were extremely busy. Thank you so much. Stick around, we have Shar Carilla when In The Mix returns.